Hey everybody, this is Jason with Lone Star Catfish and uh, I am actually fishing. So no fitness update for this one. Um, didn't really want to mess with the boat today. Didn't want to lug the kayak out. Um, so I just came out here to the shore. Um, and I'm actually, main purpose was to try out my new rod. So, um, you know, where I fish right here, it is extremely shallow. I mean, I could probably walk 100 yards out there and not even really get up to my chest. So you really need 100, 150 yards to get out there to even five or six foot deep. Um, so I bought these surf rods, which are 12 foot long, uh, rated for up to a four ounce weight, uh, which is what I have on both of these. And I'm just jacking these out there as far as I can. I get a, did a couple test casts and reels. I'm getting around 140, maybe 150 yards. Uh, I still don't think I'm doing it very well, if that makes sense. You know, there's an art to that long cast, um, but I've got it out there quite far. I've got my other rod here, kind of my normal, I and mean, it's got to be no more than 50, 60 yards out there. Uh, so I got all three of those going. I'm fixing to rig up another one with a slightly different hook, and then I'm going to put that one out there too. But I'm just going to sit here and enjoy the afternoon. Um, a little overcast. We've had some rain, so the, the lake's up a little bit. Um, but I think as, as the sun starts to, to go down a little bit, hopefully we'll get a little bite. I had one little nibble over here. I need to go check it out. Um, and other than that, you know, I'm fishing, right? So for once, I'm not working out and, uh, and not eating. I'm, I'm just fishing. My biggest challenge is I've barely caught any bait. I came down here. I didn't bring any bait. I was going to catch it all. I've caught like six shad. So um, I'm going to do the best I can. Uh, and as soon as I get done here, I'm going to be walking up along this bulkhead, probably catching maybe one, two at a time at the most, but, but I got to keep going because I'm going to run out of bait real quick. So that's all I got. Hopefully we'll catch some fish and we'll put a video together. So here we go. Sometimes you get bites and you think you've lost them. And they just decide to kind of give up on you out there. And I just know what this guy was doing. He's just been laying there waiting for me to maybe forget about him. Had a good hook set on him. If you've been watching any of my videos, really been working on these hooks since this is a five lot double action cat a team catfish that got is in the lip wasn't coming out so that's a good good hook set right there not a bad little fish i wonder if he didn't have that line right away just laying down there couldn't move all right well, we got the skunk out we didn't waste anything Thank you. 
65 a little over 28 inches So I was about to cast this back out there, and I'm getting it wrapped off the end of, of the uh, the tip there, the line, and the hook just bloop, falls right off. My snail completely came off. I mean, look at that. I mean, I, I had to have been seconds away from losing that fish. I cannot believe that. I, I'm going to have to re-snail it. Think about what I did, I, I don't even understand it. So, well, that was lucky. Oh, boy, I was watching that one down there. And this one took off. Oh, okay. He's coming at me, he's coming at me. He's coming right at me. Right here, I mean, he just reeled himself all the way to the freaking bulkhead. Ugh. And it's buried. It definitely was not going to come out. There he is. It's not quite as big as the last one, but that is a beautiful fish. All right. You can see that. 
7.6, 7.6 pounds. Not bad. Not bad. Let's get a let's get a length on him. Right at 26 pounds. Very nice. Or 26 pounds. 26 inches. I wish 26 pounds, right? about 520. Sunset is imminent here and it's going to get chilly. Uh, it is Sunday night so I'm going to get home uh, have dinner get ready for the week. So hey good trip. <laughs> Got a good blue on each of my new big 12 foot uh, surf rods basically what they are. Really was able to get the big cast and look could be total coincidence that I was able to get bigger fish with longer casts Again, I'm guessing in that 120 to 140 yard range, and that's just a guess from how many reels. I know it, this thing is is just a little over two foot per reel. Um, you know, I was reeling in 70, 74 times, something like that. So it's it's got to be up there. That you know, I'll go as low as 120 if I'm wrong on my on my reeling uh, up to uh, you know 140. So about 140 yards out there, and I caught two big blue cats. So. Um, I don't think that's a coincidence, that was my plan, but obviously time will tell. Uh, just the one little blue on these red rods here, uh, and really nothing else. I had one other good bite like while I was fighting that first big fish um, and wasn't able to land him. Um, but hey, I can't complain about this day. Two big fish like that in, you know, was this four or five hours that I was out here, uh, especially considering that I barely caught any bait. So I managed to do that on uh, very little bait. Uh, fortunately, I caught one really big shad, and I was able to catch that first one on the head uh, and the second one on one of the body section. So, fantastic day. I couldn't be happier. Um, I'll sit here and see if I can't grab anything else on these other three as I get myself uh, put together. Uh, but unless, unless that happens, this is it for me. Good day. We'll see you next time. All right, guys, I can't end this video without correcting a bonehead math mistake. I was getting two foot per reel, and I was reeling 70 times to reel that thing in. So that's 140 feet, not yards. Uh, that's what, uh, that's how good of a, a math major I am. So that, that a lot of good my math degree did. So 140 feet, obviously divide that by three, and you're looking at less than 50 yards. So um, I'm going to have to do maybe a little bit more work. We'll get 50 yards out there. I was hoping to get 100, 100, you know, at least 100 yards. And I'm only getting 50 yards out there. So um, I'm going to have to look at that again. Uh, and I think a lot of it's technique, just getting better uh, at, at casting. But either way, it's definitely farther than I'm getting with these red ones. If that's 50 yards, I'm getting... 30 yards or so with these other ones at most. So, um, either way, longer cast, bigger fish. Okay, so I corrected myself. Thanks. Oh, baby, too much attention, not enough attention, but you're gonna